Hi guys, I'm Exact Chaos, and welcome back to another episode of Another Brick in the Mall. Okay, so in the last episode we sorted out Corner Chow a little bit from the management department, and I'm thinking some of these stores have a little bit of a funny operating regime, so I might just go back and have a look at these two, three stores over here as well. What we've also done is we've expanded the mall down a little bit further, we've added one or two more speciality stores, We've added place, uh, some room for many, many more stores. And we really want to kind of get a big anchor in this corner over here. But we need to get there first. How is our profits going? Yeah, pretty decent. It's starting to rise again. But we, we haven't seen those 40k levels in a very, very long time. And I'm not sure that the people in queues are really resulting in that not happening. What I am thinking is that a lot of these speciality stores that I've added more recently are not operating at a decent profit. And so it's, it's kind of taking away from the jewelry store and those kind of guys that we have over here that made a ton of profit initially. And maybe, to be honest, that is a good extra new, new one for us to look into. Let's pop one of these stores as another jewelry store to see if we can't drag some more cash in here. Okay, so let's see, not manage, I want to build a few things, so let's add some objects, get the tables in here, and we'll pop them in like such. I'm keen on this extra new jewelry store to see if that's going to up our profits a little bit or whether we're kind of set on jewelry. Uh, and to be honest, what I can do is I can actually, oops, I don't want to do this, let's go back out. I can have a look over here to see if we still have a decent demand for jewelry or not. Big demand for bowling. Oh, no, no. This is yesterday's sales more than the demand. So the demand... No. Other way around, right? Yes. Other way around. Okay. So um, so the demand is 95, but the sales are only 44. So, yes. We can, we ha can have another bowling alley. Movies. We should have more demand but i never see the movies actually full so maybe what i should do is add an extra person to to get the queues going but i haven't got an issue with the queues yet liquor we can add another liquor store another tier three demand is still pretty high soda soda is doing well we can probably add a little bit but soda is doing well candies are doing well bottled water we can add some more of that beer yeah Wine as well, canned food is good, breakfast cereal is good, snacks, ice cream, milk, cookies, dairy, all good. Fresh meat, we can add something. Sliced bread is good, sauce and seasoning good, frozen vegetables, rice and pasta is good, frozen pizza is good. Fresh fish, we need a fresh fish store. That is definitely a ton of demand that we can do with over here. Uh, fresh meat, we are doing well with fresh meat. So what we'll do is we'll add another butchery and just make sure that we've got more fresh fish than fresh meat because we can pop in an extra bit of demand over there. Uh, actually, to be honest, it's a tier 3 demand. So we need a, a separate meat store and fish store. Okay, we can do that. Coffee and tea, good. Pet food, detergents. Yeah, I can sell a little bit more soap and shampoo. Cosmetics, tooth care. So Groom Me Up definitely needs another. So we need another version of Groom Me Up somewhere. Type is good, toilet paper, light bulbs, electricity, car tools, hand tools, power tools, toys, books. Books? Really? Toys and books can both do some more. Video games, even more. Music CDs, first aid. Yeah, bed sheets, drugs. Oh, we need a drug? No, no, we'd have a drug store. But we've got a ton of demand. So a tier 3 store that only sells kind of drugs. Is that right? That's interesting. Okay, that, that's something we can do and look into. Men's shoes. Wow. We don't have a men's shoe store. Oh, interesting. We've got a women's shoe store, but we need a men's shoe store. So let's do that. Let's pop a men's shoe store or another shoe store in there with more men's shoes than women's shoes. Okay, let's do that. And a drugstore. Those are things we need. Uh, <clears throat> what I was checking was jewelry. Yeah, we can do with some more jewelry. So what I'll do is I'll pop in another jewelry store as I was doing. Over here. So let's uh, assign, ooh, not a storage, a store. Like so. And we will manage that store. 
uh, and let's just pause it a little bit manage manage the store this new store we've got over here this store can get from uh, this storage over here right we want to pop the hours into the standard hours for us like so we need to add some staff um, I'll do this one and that's pretty good okay so let's set the hours appropriately nice we'll hire a stock clerk I'm kind of wondering about the stock clerks right do we need two stock clerks or will one stock clerk do the trick I am thinking we might be okay with a single stock clerk and I can probably do a full scale cut on most of my stores really um, okay, so let's grab someone that's decent at being a stock clerk. So we'll get Patricia over here. And Patricia will start work at 6 and she'll work for 10 hours. And then we'll try with just one stock clerk. At least for a jewelry store, I think that's pretty decent. What should our jewelry store name be? Um, let's call it Carrots. <laughs> that's pretty good carrots uh, and now what I still want to do is pop in a piece of floor tile over there this kind of my OCD jumps up a little bit if I don't do this uh, but that's pretty decent okay now on the other side what is this is this just drugs 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 nice just drugs okay and what else do we have first aid so both of those they're saying we've got more demand for it is that correct Oh, shoe store. Forget about the drugs for now. I'm going to do another shoe store. So shoes goes on just normal shelves. And this will be a men's shoe store. So we'll get give me some objects. And we'll go for the shelves. And we'll pop them in here. No. Like so and so and so. So, so and so. And like so. What I'll do is I'll do mainly men's shoes and then move over into, into a bit of women's shoes to match those demands. So over there, let's manage this new store. Um, assign a storage area, this one over here. Um, get the hours of operation in line with the mall's hours of operation, like so. we we'll get uh, the staff required. Mm, cashier. Yeah, Jackie can do the trick. Jackie is good. And yeah, Lucas, let's get Lucas in there. Okay, so just do that. Um, I'm just going to do the one stock clerk uh, move again over here. So let's uh, pick up Joel. Right, Joel looked pretty decent. Yeah, Joel is decent. And Joel will start work at 6 for 10 hours. Yeah, good. Okay, good. Uh, this store can be um ooh, let's do uh walk the line anybody know where that's from okay uh walk the line nice we've got storage assigned and we need shelves okay the shelves will make their way here soon okay yeah are the shelves ooh, well I keep going on that so these ones will be, uh, ooh, I want clothing, men's shoes, clothing, men's shoes, and men's shoes, and some more, right, and this middle one will be men's shoes again, so that we have more than 50% men's shoes, and get the tier 3, okay, there we go, and then this one, I'll have some women's shoes in here, so we can meet more women's shoe demand, uh, but we've got a women's shoe. Uh, we, this is not uh, ultimately a women's shoe store. Just a shoe store, really. Okay, there we go. Ooh. Has this store been set up or not? A sign? Oh, carrots has been signed, but we didn't actually put jewelry on the tables. So. Oh, clothing, jewelry. I don't think jewelry is clothing, but um, apparently it is. Clothing accessory, maybe. Okay, do jewelry. Nice. And some more, some more, and some more. I'm hoping jewelry store will make a lot of money. Nice. Our mall is getting a nice shape. 
and the money is rolling in, we can probably start looking at, wow, look at this. People are going through the food court area over here. Okay, what else is a problem? Um, how smart? We'll get back to that if that comes again. Corner chow still? No, really, corner chow shouldn't, shouldn't be problematic, really. I'm going to get that one out. Uh, how smart is still a problem. Oof, Housemart is doing poorly. So let's quickly go and manage Housemart. Uh, Housemart. Where is Housemart? Somewhere here. Yeah, here we go. Staffing. So someone didn't arrive for work, and that's the problem here, right? Two. There should be two all the time. And someone did obviously not come to work. So let's just add another person. Yeah, and another one. Anybody good? Yeah, over here. And that covers all three of, of those. Okay, so let's, uh, oops, keep that going. So everything's good. How smart we can clean out. Yummy Delight. Check out queues are full. We'll keep an eye on Yummy Delight. General store I know and eat and run I know. I want to get rid of both of them. As soon as we get to the bottom here, we can do a nice big um, anchor store, anchor general store over here and, and kind of chop that out completely. And what I can do, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'll do with the rest of the area over there, but yeah, we'll definitely do that. Nice, people are arriving to work. There's a lot of staff parking. And while I'm around here, let's add some more. More staff only parking. Yeah, that should be pretty decent. There's a lot of other parking. We haven't had another parking issue, but we'll pick this side will become parking too. And especially as we open this side over here. Nice. Okay, oh, that's just the parking being done. We've got the jewelry coming in. People are already buying. Expensive. Nice. I want to sell more jewelry. So it's going to sell much, much more jewelry. Wow, the liquor store is doing well. Everything else, decent. Yeah. The shoe store is busy. Wow, nice. Okay, so what's our first complaint? is the eat and run i'm ignoring eat and run for the moment until i get to the bottom here and can add some more and eat and run again what is going on with eat and run though we've got wow look at this that is pretty damn insane wow that's really insane really insane yeah i know eat and run eat and run eat and run yummy delight Okay, so Yummy Delight needs an extra person. So let's quickly manage Yummy Delight to sort out that issue. Where is Yummy Delight? Over there. Let's get... Wow, look at this. This is losing so much money. So an extra... And again, we've got two cashiers working. It's just one that didn't pitch up for work. So I really can't do much about that. Okay, so keep going. Keep, keep going. <clears throat> the other thing I can consider is actually popping two into one and making this a bigger store. Might be a decent, uh, decent proposition, actually. Everything else doing good? Yeah, jewelry. Where is this going? Oh, look at that. It's going up. It's most definitely going up. Nice. That is pretty damn decent. We're making a bit more profit now. And what I'm wondering about is I am going to do that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to cull a lot of the stock clerk jobs. So let's go through these. So from uh, we're starting at Things Boutique. Uh, Oh, I hate this that there's new things in there. All kinds of food. So all kinds of food is just barely making a profit. What's the staff like? 
we only have one stock clerk working here okay then that's fine then that one will not go under the knife uh, what we can however do is get rid of one of the cashiers that are working the kind of lighter shift what is happening with our cashiers 848 848 and then 16 and 16 for 8 and these ones 8 for 8 and 16 for 7 no let's get rid of carol yes let's fire carol that looks nicely in that shape over there okay so next one is things boutique let's have a look we've got four okay working so from a cashier point of view that's probably decent stock clerks however six for nine hours and i'm um, sorry susan you're going to be kicked out though so let's fire susan right only a single stock clerk will be working this store and probably do a stretch to 10 hours and that should keep it decent Keep it decent, all kinds of food. The stock clerk is yeah, working a hell of a long time, actually. Uh, I want to start earlier and maybe let's just drop it down a little bit to 10 hours. Just get a decent work there. Grab a bevy. What is going on with the people working at Grab a bevy? 8 to 8. I mean, 8 for 8 hours, 16 for 8 hours. 8 for 8 hours, 16 for 8 hours. 8 for 8 and 16 for 7 hours. No, it should be 8 hours, right? Okay, and we only have a single stock clerk. Should start at six and work for let's do nine hours over there. Standard. Okay, so that should be fine. Now the next one, cool stuff electronics. Uh, eight to eight and sixteen for eight, and a single stock clerk uh, should probably start a little bit earlier and only work like the nine hours over there. Get everything stocked up nicely again in the morning. Yeah, is that good? should be fine okay next corner chow i've sorted corner chow out most more recently knock them down bowling um can i do something to fit in an extra bowling alley i think i can so let's have a quick look so let's uh what i want to do is let's uh, remove an object that that one over there and we'll add an object we'll have that same order counter over there and what I'm going to do is this one I'm going to rotate and do the other way around like so and in doing so where the hell is my cashier in doing so what I can do is I can add an extra bowling lane in there and that should help us out a little bit so let's manage knock them down bowling and see we've got two cashiers working one after the other <coughs> and will that do we need someone else to work here i don't think so i think this is fine probably this is fine what i'm wondering about is if we go to oh, okay let's check the appliance hub ever so quickly the appliance hub has got uh, two stock clerks which i don't necessarily think is required so let's uh, let's uh, get rid of colin Sorry, Colin, uh, and the rest should be fine. Yeah, and yeah, that's fine. Okay, should make a little bit more money doing that. Uh, how did our money go yesterday? Another drop, another drop. I don't understand. Oh, it's this that's making that noise. Okay, now, okay, so let's move on to exact cinemas and see what we've got over here. It's still the same operating hours. Cashiers, yeah, two cashiers all the time okay so let's add a third yeah let's just do that let's just do an extra cattle please come back yeah and someone else i don't want a stock clerk though i want a cashier so let's uh, just pop up don and don can move in there and then we've got three and that should really do the trick right good okay uh now let's move on to oh so shiny doing well we had a bit of a drop in sales because i think the other store has opened up uh as a staff like shall we shall we get rid of joseph yes let's fire joseph sorry joseph we can't deal with you anymore drop those hours just a little bit of the sales do we need an extra i don't think so i'm not going to do that just yet okay bottle o 
Okay, let's uh, want to get rid of one of the stock clerks. Fire, thank you. Uh, meat galore. Yeah, uh, fire. Thank you. And yummy delights. Uh, yummy, de oof, definitely not four stock clerks. Come on. I need two, but I'm definitely gonna gonna fire one for each of the hours. Thank you. Um, so we should have a stock clerk running through the entire time. Uh, e zone. Two stock clerks, not not required. Fire. Thank you. Okay, so that I'm hoping that'll make a, make us some more money. Now, Hungerama. Does Hunger Rama need more people? I, to be honest, I don't think so. I think Hunger Rama does well as is. What is this guy's issue? What's wrong, buddy? What, what was your issue? Uh, how do I select to see what's your problem? Going home. Alcoholic, irritable, weak stomach, <coughs> nausea, bladder. Customers with full bladder will go home if no restrooms are available at your center. We have restrooms, man. Bought fast food, bought jackets, queuing for jackets, browsing jackets, looking for jackets. Wow. Bought coffee, blah, blah, blah. At the general store. Wow. I need a coffee store or something. Need a new general store. That's what I need. Okay, keep going. That's fine. I don't think Angarama has got issues. And I think that's where I'll kind of end the management of this. I think all of this is going to be okay. What else do we have over here? General store, eat and run, and yummy delight. I think I've sorted yummy delight. Uh, those other two are still okay. Popped in some new stores. What did we make? We're shooting right back up, but, uh, but that's okay. 300k. So what I'm going to do is let's lay out our new foundation build some foundations and let's run this wow it's expensive i need so much money so much start building like so <clears throat> and then when we'll, once we've done that we're gonna pop it out this way but i i like the the shape that we've got going on over here the 36 is a is a decent size and i like it i definitely like it Okay, so that's underway. The construction there is underway, and I can keep filling this up as well. I've gone through the management of some of these stores a little bit, just to make sure that we've got not a, not billions and billions of stock clerks working. Working. That should help us out a little bit more. To just make turn a little bit of a better profit. And what we'll also need to do is expand parking on this side. This is a bit of a funny shape that I've run through here, really. Yeah, not really efficient. This this is probably the most efficient layout that I've got going on, is this one that I'm running down here. Really efficient. Okay, what else, what else? I'm how, how are this the movies full? The bowling is full again, or well, not quite full, but almost. Yeah, no, I think the bowling is doing well. The movies, yeah, people are filling, oh, actually now filling up the seats a fair bit more. They should be able to get into the movies more. I'm wondering if it if we add extra kinnies to the movies, whether it uh, or cinemas or theaters or whatever. Whether that uh, that adds adds to the demand or the the reduction of the demand, a fish store, we need a fish store. But we will do that in the next episode. So I'm Exact Chaos, and this has been another brick in the mall. Exactly. If you've liked this episode, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Thank you. Bye bye.